Today's video is gonna be really exciting because when I open this trunk up, you're gonna see the first ever BMW M2 GTS taillights. So let's get into that right now. And under here, you can see these beautiful GTS taillights. They're fully plug and play, they look amazing. And honestly, I've been wanting to install sequential turn signals or GTS taillights on my M2 for so long now. So I'm so happy that these finally came out. And from what I know, this is the first ever BMW M2 to get GTS taillights on YouTube. So this is gonna be an amazing video. I'm really excited to do this. So let's get straight into the install. Let's open this trunk up and get our first tool. It's just a flathead screwdriver. We're gonna need to come here. There's one cover right here for bolts and one cover right over there. We're just gonna pop the screwdriver in over here. There we go, super easy. Let's get our 10 mil socket and unbolt them. There we go, they're all loosened off. And there's a little pull thing here, as you can see on this light. So I'll just pull this out like that. And this plug right here should just come out. There we go. So this is what the old taillights look like. And here is the GTS taillight. Beautiful. And here is a side-by-side -side comparison of the two taillights. There's one thing that I forgot in the install process. As you see over here, there's a sort of plastic lining here and some uh, weather stripping. But then if we go over to the GTS taillight, there isn't anything. So what we've had to do is pop this off of the left one. So now it looks like this. And it's very simple. There are a bunch of these little clips here, like so. This part's gonna go underneath, like that. And then you're just gonna clip them on, which I'll show you right now. And it really is that simple. We're all good to go. All right, the next thing we wanna do is plug this into here. It's literally directly plug and play. Let me go this way. Cool. So before I bolt these in, let's do a test startup to see if this works. And of course, we don't wanna forget about this tail light. Slide this in there for now. And let's get this going. I'm really excited to see this. They didn't do anything yet. Oh, I know why. Oh, <laughs> that is so cool. Oh man, that is really cool. Wow, that looks really good. <laughs> oh, that's cool. That's really cool. look absolutely amazing, but they aren't perfect. Let's talk about the pros and cons of the M2 GTS taillights. The pros are pretty easy. They look fantastic. They were really easy to install and the fitment is pretty much perfect. I'm also a huge fan of the sequential turn signals. But on the other hand, they're quite a bit dimmer than the OEM taillights. They're still bright enough to see clearly, but when you look at the GTS taillights beside the OEM ones, you can see that there's quite a difference. Which brings me on to what they look like during the day. The OLEDs are pretty hard to see when it's light out, but at least the turn signals and brake lights are pretty bright and they can be seen whether it's day or night. I'm also not a huge fan of the reverse lights as you can't really see where you're backing up quite as well as you can with the OEM lights. But if you're not living in a place where it's really dark and there aren't any street lights, it's not really a problem. And hands down, the biggest con of them all is they look so good yet you don't really see them all that much. The only time you really see them is when you're walking up to the car to unlock it, and that's only if you have your lights on auto or in the on position. Overall, I really like the M2 GTS taillights, and I'll be keeping them on my car. After all, I've been wanting something like this for months now. But before we end off today's video, there's two more things that I've got to tell you about. The turn signals change color? Well, not really. What actually happens is that when it's dark out, they look amber, like a Euro spec BMW, but when you're in garage lighting or in the daylight, they look a little bit more red. While the GTS taillights look great on video, they look a lot better in person. It's hard to describe, but in person they look a lot richer and more vivid. Anyway, thank you so much for watching today's video. If you'd like to see how I did my custom interior lighting, watch the video on the top left. 